Hi, I am Ni Xu from Nanjing University. Thanks for watching this video abstract. We know that in a two-dimensional electronic system with a perpendicular magnetic field, we will observe one-way edge currents protected by the non-trivial topological properties of the energy bands. And the non-trivial topological properties are caused by the time reversal symmetry breaking induced by the magnetic field. Similarly, in an optical system, researchers utilize gyromagnetic photonic crystals to realize one-way electromagnetic edge states. We know that acoustic waves also have wide applications in our daily life, such as medical imaging and underwater communication. But how to realize topologically protected one-way edge states in an acoustic system? Here, we introduce a circulating air flow into an acoustic ring cavity to break the time reversal symmetry. The circulating air flow will generate an effective vector potential, and it will provide an additional phase for sound propagation inside the ring. But this phase is different for clockwise and counterclockwise propagation, therefore leading to the time reversal symmetry breaking of this acoustic system. Then, we utilize these airflow circulated units to constitute a sonic crystal. In the case without airflow, the red curve in figure C shows the corresponding frequency bands, and we notice several degenerate points, such as the direct points, around 723 Hz. However, when the airflow is introduced, the black curve shows that all these degeneracies are lifted due to the broken time reversal symmetry induced by airflow. To demonstrate the non-trivial topological properties of the frequency bands, we utilize tight binding model to analyze the chain numbers around the direct point. The nearest neighbor rings are connected by the waveguide without airflow, so there is no additional phase at the nearest hopping term. However, the second nearest hopping path will occupy one third of another ring, and the airflow inside the ring will induce an effective vector potential, generating an additional phase phi. In our case, phi is minus 2 pi over 3, and so the gap chain number is minus 1. We know that the sign of the gap chain number denotes the propagation direction of acoustic edge states. Here, in our case, the gap chain number of minus 1 indicates that the acoustic edge states will propagate counterclockwise along the boundaries. Because the non-trivial topological properties belong to the bulk bands, local disturbances on the boundaries will not break this bulk property, and so the one-way edge states are robust to any defects on the boundaries here. We show four cases with different boundary defects, and all of them show robust one-way propagations. In summary, we have realized topologically protected one-way acoustic edge states by utilizing a sonic crystal containing circulating airflow. The introduction of airflow breaks the time reversal symmetry of the sonic crystal and induces non-trivial topological properties of acoustic bands. The chain numbers of the associated acoustic bands are verified to be non-zero by our tight binding model, and the simulated field distributions demonstrate that the one-way edge states are robust to various kinds of defects on the boundaries. These results may have potential applications in acoustic device design, such as acoustic dyes, and improve the understanding of topological phenomena in acoustics.